this building's over there. Welcome, here. welcome, welcome to my channel. This is Cresta Maria Standen, and we're here at the Cascade of Time Garden in Banff. Come. It's well maintained, darling. Oh, what is that? What the building was for originally now. What's it used for now? Yeah, we can go in. Let's check out. Oh, here. There's a way here. Well, there are only a few tourists roaming around. It's fans. Oh no. They're doing some work. Oh, is that a fountain? Look at the garden. Oh. Yeah, I think that's the fountain. That's the fountain. Administration. Administration for what? Wow. Look at that. Nick. So this is fans. The uh, the HQ, the HQ, of the National Park Service. Ah. Read that out. It's interesting. So. In 1911, Canada established the first national park service in the world. What began as a cluster of parks in the Rocky Mountains gradually became became a national system fostering tourism and economic growth while upholding conservation ideals. In 1914, the definition of a Dominion Park was expanded to include significant historic places laying the groundwork for a modern system of, eco of iconic national parks and national historic sites which welcome millions of visitors annually and initiating a tradition of national and international leadership in the management of protected places that continues for this day so this is a historic site uh, we cannot get in yeah we cannot get in would you like to take a picture of that no would you like to take a picture or you're good okay we can go on this side and then go back you don't need a flash for that no, that's just to make you light up, so you're less... Mm -hmm. you know, when, when I first met you, <laughs> well, never, you know, at some point, I thought, I do remember thinking, oh, maybe I'll never get fat when she gets older, because she's too vain. <laughs> Is that a Chinese thing? But it's, or it's, it's I think it's new. Oh, this is just like a, a garden where you can park, picnic for the day, right? What is this? Head to a public servant. Okay. We're going to go all the way up there. I think this is it. Just to go. 
the gazebo in this garden maintained by Kuya. Kuya is watering the plants. Done? Oh, but this one is look at the pans with algae you can actually go up there Nick It's beautiful. Oh, this is like a falls water coming from here all the way down to that and stops there
huge garden. I think that's the way to stop if there's a bear in the area. So I think this this is fence to stop the bear coming in or any wildlife. Right? Yes, yes totally. Because if there are people hanging around here. <laughs> yeah. You got deer and you can go too. Yeah. That's why it's fence. Mosquitoes everywhere again. <laughs> Squirming mosquitoes. Oh, okay. This is not really maintained. <laughs> this part. <laughs> I love the place. Really good. Yeah. As I've said earlier, this car this park, this garden is fence to keep out the wild life, wild animals that will eat the plants. Or, de or destroy this garden. Look at that. It's awesome. But this part is not well maintained. But look at that. All wild flowers. If you have nothing to do here in Banff and then you just want to have a picnic, you can come here, spend the day with your kids or alone if you want to read in the park. Yeah. It's really good. Oh. This is fence, so we cannot go down there, but... Look at that. It's interesting. This is a great woodwork. It is very relaxing here. Look at that view beds of flowers different kinds i'm not sure what is this but this is a different kind of flower and over there as well you can see it's all orange and yellow and this one is red that one is all lavender okay and this one is different as well I love this. Look at this. Red beds of flowers. And then this is lavender. Wow. This one too. Look at that. It's amazing.
really great view. Okay folks, so this is the Cascade Garden and thank you for watching and please like, share and subscribe my video.